<laughs> I digress in my my poor bluegrass abilities. B7, very cool chord. The way that this one works, it's uh, it requires all four fingers. It's a little bit trickier than your average seventh chord. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna start by doing middle finger fifth string second fret. Should get that note. We're not playing the low string. Dead. Second fret, uh, fifth string with the middle finger. First finger is going to get the fourth string, first fret. Should have that note. Going to follow through with the third finger on the second fret, second fret, third string. Should be getting that note. You're going to have an open second string, and your pinky is going to come down at the second fret on the first string. So you're using everything now. Here's the close up. Okay, B7. Very usable, very nice usable seventh chord. B7 works is you don't use the low string. You start with the fifth string, the A string that is, middle finger, second fret. First finger comes over, grabs the first fret on the fourth string. Third finger comes underneath. It's tricky. And it's getting the second fret on the third string. Should be getting that note. Then you have an open second string. Then your pinky comes down on the first string, second fret. So just about everything's at the second fret. It looks very cluttered. With time, it actually won't feel too cluttered at all. It's a pretty comfortable shape to get to once you've learned it. So again, you have second fret, first fret, second fret. Uh, wait, what did I just say? <laughs> That's right, sorry. Uh, second string open. 2nd fret high string, so 2nd fret 1st fret, 2nd fret open string, 2nd fret. That's your B7 chord.